everyone, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, hello and welcome. My name is Jessica of the blog Miss More Style. Here on YouTube, I make videos about affordable fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and travel. Um, and today I have a shopping haul for you all. It's going to be a short and sweet haul from Cupshe Swimwear. Cupshe reached out to me a couple weeks ago and asked if I would like to try out their swimwear in exchange for doing a haul video. And I said, of course, because I've definitely heard of Cupshe for the last couple seasons, but just haven't ever like went ahead and bought anything from them. So I'm super excited to try this swimwear out with you guys um, and see how it fits, especially because if you are a subscriber or you have watched my videos before, you might have caught my previous swimwear video. Uh, and that one was a bit of a struggle. Let's just say I have a really difficult time finding swimwear that is on trend, that is affordable, but also that fits my top half properly uh, because I am a size six, but I have a 34 double D chest. So I find that it gets difficult, especially when you're trying to get tops that fit you, but also like bottoms that also fit your bottom half. It's just really hard. And I feel like a lot of the trendy swimsuits that you find that are like super affordable and super cheap usually are not made with people with big boobs in mind. Cupshe is a, an affordable swimwear brand. All of their swimwear ranges somewhere around $25, but like maybe the most expensive one that I saw was $35. So it's like extremely affordable. That's for a top and a bottom together. They also have swimsuit cover-ups. They have fun like beach wear. It's, they have like just really fun, vibrant designs that are unique that just scream like fun and summery. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this haul. You can find all the links to the suits that I'm going to try on and show you down below in my description box. First of all, I just have to comment on the fact that they come in these really cute little plastic packagings. Cup sheet, live life on the beach. I mean, if I could... I would cup she. First suit is a two piece. I got this in a size medium. So the bottoms are leopard print and they are really, really high waisted, but I would say like cut cheeky on the bottom. And the front is kind of like gathered. See how there's like extra material there. It's supposed to look a little bit gathered on your front half. And I find that when the uh, high waisted swimsuits do that, it kind of helps to like camouflage any like belly that you might want to hide. So that is a really cute feature of these bottoms. And then the top is going to look like absolutely nothing until I put it on because that's what this type of top is. But it's a black top that has like <laughs> this like ruffle right here. And then this long string is supposed to like crisscross around your torso. I really liked this because I felt like top could be worn as like a top top in real life if I'm feeling confident that day um, because that like floss like crisscross situation is like a huge trend this year um if you caught my spring 2021 trends video then you saw that i figured like maybe i could use this as like a bralette top in real life as well so i don't know let's try it on and see. so this suit i really um really wanted to like i got it in a medium the bottoms of course fit really well i feel like they are yeah they fit perfectly actually i feel like the top being a medium i should have gotten a large or i should wear a large top because i feel like a large would give me a little bit extra fabric, but I feel like I can make this work. The only thing I will say about this is it's a slight bit uncomfortable because you have to crisscross the ties, um, these long ties across your torso. And you gotta pull them really, really tight because otherwise you're gonna fall out of the top. Super cute otherwise, if you have a smaller chest, I feel like this would work out a little bit better, but again, I think I can still make it work. And I love this like ruffle sleeve detail. I love the bottoms too. I feel like this leopard print is super fun. I like this suit. It's really, really cute. And I feel like the tops and bottoms are really great pieces that you could intermix with other bathing suits that you already own like interchangeably for like a fun mix and match look. The next suit that I got is so much fun. It is also a two piece. And this one has just this really cute little like uh, faux belt situation going on here with this fun little cutout. And there's the back. They are pretty cheeky, I will say, just from looking at it right off the bat. And you can see that they're cut like really high leg, which I love that. I feel like the high leg thing um, was out of style for a while and it's been like really back for the last like three or four seasons. When it first came back in, I was like, oh my God, that is like so 80s. Like I remember seeing like photos of like my mom in like swimsuits similar to this and just thinking like a long time ago and like we were all wearing those like hipster type things that like were really low rise, just being like, oh my God, it looks so like weird. But now I'm like, hell no, this thing is that those hipster ones were not because these make your legs look so long. The top is just like a simple bandeau um, and it's got these straps that you can adjust to your liking. Um, I really like the material. It kind of like feels like a little bit like ribbed, I want to say, or like gathered. I don't really know. Ruched? 
what the word is for that. It has little cups in there, but you could remove them. I'll probably remove them because I just don't really enjoy having cups in my swim tops, but that's totally up to you. Um, but yeah, I just feel like this is like so fun and bright and cheery. So this swimsuit is so much fun. I feel like it's just like so cheery and like fun and playful. I had to pair this with my little lemon earrings that I got recently from, um, I think I got these from Marshall's. So they go with this um, swimsuit so freaking perfectly. First of all, the bottoms are pretty cheeky, but I don't feel like they're like insanely cheeky like some of the ones that I've tried on from other uh, company. So it's like just the right amount where I feel like actually really comfortable in these and I don't feel like self-conscious about showing too much of my derriere, if that makes sense. They're really high-waisted. They got this little cutout right here, which I think is such a cool and different sort of detail on swim bottoms. This little like faux uh, belt buckle looking thing that's right here. It's not really a belt. It's just like this little acrylic uh, piece. This is just a really great suit. I love that the straps are fully adjustable. I feel really comfortable in this. I feel like I can move around. I could maybe play beach volleyball. I can definitely swim. Um, I feel very secure in this swimsuit, which I know is really important to some people. This is not just like a lounge around and look hot bathing suit, although it does look really cute if I do say so myself. The next one is a one piece. This is the only one piece of this haul and it is a good one. Um, first of all, look at this. It has got that one shoulder situation going on. It is like a color blocked two tone one piece. These two pieces of fabric are separated and they are tied together with this string which i thought was just so freaking cool it just gives like a little like peak of skin definitely really fun very saturated colors i love that about it and then there's the back it's just solid and yeah i, I feel like this one is pretty cheeky as well I, in general i feel like most swimsuits are cheeky i know some people that's not their preference like some people want that full coverage but that's just not really the way fashion is right now so you're gonna be hard pressed to find a more full coverage suit that is like has elements that are on trend in my opinion from what I've seen so I don't know maybe it's just time to embrace the booty being out a little bit you know one thing I really appreciate about this one piece that I just want to say is the reason why I don't get one pieces very often is because I feel like when you have a bigger chest it's just one piece right and it unless it's a one piece that has built in like underwire or cups into it if it's just like a you know one piece of fabric type of deal it has nothing to like hold the girls support them like make them look good at all this one if you look on the inside of the bathing suit how it's constructed i don't know if you're gonna be able to see it but it's got somewhat of like a liner like right underneath to help that hits right there so it kind of helps hold them up just a tiny bit just just a tiny bit and it's really all you need so i'm pretty impressed by that little feature i wish more one pieces would have that in them so this one, I, you know, I, I had to go for a one, one piece. I usually am not like a huge fan of them because I feel like when you have like a larger bust, they just don't like make things look good. But this one just looked so freaking cool on the website and it did not disappoint on. I love it. I love that it's like kind of like sporty, but also a little bit sexy. So you've got this like big gap that goes diagonally across your uh, upper body and it's tied together with this little, um, it's not a rope. It feels like scuba, like swimsuit material that's like made into a rope. But what I love about it is if you want to tie it up completely and you want to have only just a little bit of sliver showing, you can totally adjust it to your liking. Or if you want it to be a little bit more separated, live life on the edge, you can do that too. This is the sort of separation that's comfortable for me. I feel like it shows like a little peak of skin in a different way. The back is just solid orange. Um, I just honestly think this is such a freaking cool and different bathing suit the one thing i will say is they have these little cups on the inside which are like actually kind of tiny and weird and i don't know if you can see it on the camera but they kind of like they look a little strange so i'll probably just end up taking those out it's not a big deal but just so you know like it does come with like little cups inside of it that i'm pretty sure you could remove yep you can remove them which i will do momentarily i really love this i just feel like it's something very unique and different that i don't have in my like swimsuit collection and the color combination also is just very vibrant and fun and again i got this one also in a size medium and i saved the best for last yep i saved the best for last it's my favorite one you ready are you ready here is the top how freaking cute like gingham halter top it actually has like an underwire and a cup situation they are padded and slightly push up but like nothing out of control nothing crazy um so there's that bottoms <laughs> it's so cute that ruffle it's just freaking adorable 
how much do you love that? I love that they're still cut high on the leg. They're high-waisted, and then, you know, they're kind of cheeky in the back. I mean, this is so freaking cute. I, I can't wait to try this on. All right, y'all, hands down, this is the favorite. I saved the best for last in this haul. I really, like, when I saw this online, I was like, I must have that swimsuit. It is so freaking cute. And now that I have it on, I feel so just, like, adorable. Loki, I feel like I could be in uh, the notebook in this swimsuit. You know what I'm talking about? You know that scene when they're at the beach? She's like, if you're a bird, I'm a bird. <laughs> Comment down below if you have watched the notebook about five billion times, because I know that I have. Just feel like this is the perfect like juxtaposition of something that feels kind of retro and notebook-esque, but also has a little bit more of like a modern feel. And the reason I say that is because I feel like the style of this being high-waisted, being in this gingham, being in this sort of like halter style, has the feeling of like 1950s vibes, but because the bottoms are cut like high on the leg, um, that sort of elevates it a little bit or modernizes the style of this suit a little bit. So it's just like this really cool, um, like modern, but with a retro throwback feel to it. And I freaking love that about this. The top fits fantastic. This is a medium and I was really scared that the medium wasn't gonna work for me just from like previous similar swimwear companies, but actually, the cup size of this fits really really well like it could be it could stand to be slightly bigger but i feel secure i can work with this i feel like everything is contained where it needs to be there's no weird like side boob this part doesn't feel like it's gonna like you know have a fashion faux pas at any moment um the halter makes it so you can like adjust how much like uh, sturdiness, I guess. I don't know what the word is that I'm looking for there, but you can adjust with the halter like to your comfort level. And it's just such a freaking cute suit. The bottoms are so comfortable as well. I love that they're high-waisted. I die for this little ruffle on the side. Like how freaking cute is that? Ah! This suit is like the winner of this haul. It is my favorite. Comment down below. Let me know which suit was your favorite in this haul. I always love to hear y'all's opinions. Now that we got through that haul, I just have to say, I am thoroughly surprised and impressed by Cupshe. I was a little bit jaded from my last swimsuit haul from a similar affordable brand that will not be named. Um, and so I kind of assumed that these were going to be similar in quality, similar in construction, but I was so wrong. If you have a larger chest, I would highly suggest looking into Cupshe because I feel like their sizing is way more accurate than other similar competitors. Um, for me, I just felt like all the tops here fit me great with the exception of the first one which is a little bit on the skimpy side but again i can handle it i can deal with it it is just so hard for me to find good fun like interesting swimwear and not pay a ton of money so cup chic is a big two thumbs up for me definitely check them out let me know in the description box if you've ever shopped from Cupshe before and what your experience was. Also, let me know where is your favorite place to shop for swimwear. Always looking for a new place to try. Um, so if you have like a larger chest like me and you have like a place that's like your go-to, definitely drop me a comment. Just leave me a comment and say hi. I love chit-chatting with you all down there. Thank you so much for watching, hanging out with me today. I really appreciate it. I love each and every one of you. If you're not already subscribed, definitely hit that red subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. It really does help me out a lot. And uh, I will see you guys on my next video. Bye.